I want to speculate on something here that most of you will probably think I'm crazy for. But if they have robots that are this good, and I know probably as much as you know that they have technology way, way better than they let us see, well then what's better than this? I'll get to that in a second, but first what you need to know is they practice their technology on us and see if we're smart enough to know that that's a hologram. So when they use their holograms in different ways, they know if we're gonna be able to tell the difference or not. And now back to our, what could possibly be better robotic technology than that? Cause that looks pretty good. And let me first start off by saying what it's not. It's not this. A lot of people thought this was real, but that is just a woman playing the part and doing a really good job. But that's what they also like to do, muddy the waters. So we don't know the difference. Now here's where the speculation comes in. I've done some videos on these guys, but this isn't that type of video where I say one is playing the other. Oh no, this is the video where I say, I think Keanu is literally a robot in this premiere of Sonic the Hedgehog. Why don't we first listen to what Jim has to say about playing this role? Now, a lot of people said, I don't know if you should do the Sonic the Hedgehog movie, Jim. And I thought, you know what? It's the perfect character on the dawn of the AI and robotic revolution, you know? And uh, I am, uh, I'm right in the zeitgeist right now. I'm in a sweet spot. Now, on top of looking completely lifeless here at this premiere, I want you to look at how he's moving. And as you watch his robotic, lifeless movements, I want you to also keep in mind what Jim said about being at the zeitgeist of the AI robotic movement. Now, I know Keanu is known for not being the sharpest tool in the shed, but this looks like something different to me. Now pay particular attention to how his hands move and just how robotic he seems. You and Jim Carrey. I met him for the, well, I met him socially in passing once, like six, seven years ago. Um, but then really just hanging out for the first time in London at the premiere of, of Sonic 3, yeah. That's fantastic. Yeah. And 2024 is coming to a close. Do you have anything on your bucket list for 2025? Uh, I don't want to do bucket lists. I don't want to kick buckets. I don't want to put anything in the bucket. Oh, no. I he literally misses his face where he's going to itch here. That seems off. And how he waves seems off, like... He's not human. Now, like I said, this is pure speculation. I could be a thousand percent wrong here, but I'll tell you one thing I know I'm not wrong about. The fact that they want us confused. They don't want us to be able to tell the difference between robotic and real life. And like I said, I think they intentionally muddy the waters to keep us confused because they claim these are robotics and I think these are actually just actresses again. Now, like I said, I could be wrong, and that could just be Keanu being a goof, but I would almost guarantee that we probably wouldn't be able to tell the difference between real and robotics based on the technology they have and the technology they're keeping hidden from us. But of course, this is all entertainment. I know that Jim and Keanu definitely aren't the same people, and that's definitely not a robot. 